If you've kept yourself updated with the Android universe as of recently, you should know that Google has finally released their Chromecast SDK for developer use. What that means is that any developer can now integrate Chromecast support into their product. This is great because now we can expand our Chromecast abilities to play local files or mirror screens of phones, tablets, or whatever. One of the first apps out there to take advantage of this release is Allcast, made by CyanogenMod employee Koch. Now this did have Chromecast support a couple months ago, before the SDK release, but a Chromecast update broke that support and made it much more difficult to watch local files. But now, with the integrated SDK, Koch's app allows users to send files from their phones to the television with a tap of a finger. The app looks great, following the basics of Android app design and has a very easy to follow user interface. You have different tabs on the top that organize your phone's pictures and videos and a button in the upper right used to switch to audio files. There's also another button with a star that just takes you to the Play Store to rate and review it. One thing that has bothered me was that you can't swipe left to right to switch tabs like most Android apps, you have to select the actual tab itself. Content seems to cast relatively quickly, but some pictures took much longer than others to appear on the screen. This is only a few seconds though, so it's easy to forgive. Videos are quick to play on the screen as well, and the pause slash play button responds well to touch. The scrubber is not very useful due to the 2-3 to three second lag from the phone to the television, but it doesn't hurt to have it. Anything that's casted can be controlled via the notification bar, which is an extremely useful feature so you're not subject to staying in the app at all times. A feature I would love to see included would be a lock screen control, just for ease of access. This is still a newer update to the app, so it isn't 100% polished. I tried to cast a picture from my phone's gallery app and I was presented with a floating control screen which didn't work or display my picture. But all in all, the app handles extremely well and given the ability to cast local files to this $35 dongle is a huge achievement. There are other alternatives that do the same, but I found that all cast's UI and responses were the best of the bunch. Also, it feels good knowing that my money is helping a great developer do great things. It is a good time to be a Chromecast owner.